Hi everybody, I'm Sensei Peter from Detroit. Power, peace, purpose. So today, I don't have my belt on, I don't have my top on. I'm going to teach you guys how to tie your belt. So, we've been getting a lot of reports about from the students that are saying they're having a hard time tying their belts. We've been here having some of the parents having a hard time keeping the belts tied and tying them. So I'm going to teach you guys four different ways of how to tie your belt. I wore my red shirt so you can see the contrast of my black belt and the, um, and the shirt. So you can see how I'm doing it. And hopefully you guys will have that set up so there's no more excuses. All belts will be tied during class time. Okay? So, watch me first. I'm going to teach you guys the first way. This is the way that I like to tie my belt. I, tie, I learned it this way growing up a long time ago. Actually with Sensei Richard. So, take your belt. First you want to measure it off. I forgot one part. Let me tell you. Get your belt nice and even. Measure off the ends. Just like this. Measure it off. Get it nice and straight. Take that middle part right here. Open it up. Put that right underneath your belly button. Go around your body. Put one side flat on your back. Put the other side on top. And what I like to do is I like to make a little okay symbol like that and grab my belt and go all the way around. Tucking one side under, one side on top. So when you pull it around, it looks like this. All pieces are right here, all together. Now, as you can see in the back, we want to make sure that it's all together like this. We don't want it like this when we tie it up and it's one piece up here, one piece down there. So it's twisted. We want to make sure that it's all even, nice and straight. So from here, we have all parts of the belt. We have, should be looking like three pieces. One part here, another part, and then the side that's on the bottom right there, okay? We take the side that's on top. You can go inside, pull that side underneath here, and pull it a little tighter to your body so it's nice and snug. Okay, from here, now you got two ends this way here. Okay, you're gonna take the side that's on top. You're gonna cross that over here, reach inside, grab that top, grab that same piece again, pull it out. Okay, a lot of kids like to pull like this. No, you wanna pull it out. That's the first way. Okay, let me take my belt off. I'm gonna show you part number two. The second way to tie your belt. Starts off the same way. We got it even again. Here is another way. Go around your body like this again. Same way. Down my fingers all the way across. Going through. Get it back to the same part. I'm going to go back through again. This is looking very similar to the first one. I know. And then we pull it a little snug. Now from here. This little portion right here. Okay. The side that's on top. That same piece if you will. Okay. You're going to pull that out just a little bit and tuck that in just a little bit. You're going to take this part, the bottom part, come up, turn to the side so you can see, and go inside that hole that you just created. Okay? Then pull it back out like this. We're done. That's the second way you can tie your belt. Okay. Here comes the third way. This way is a little different. So watch from here. We don't measure off the belt this time. I just use my arm length as a body example here. Pull it, hold your belt there. Take the part where this hand is here, not the end piece. This is the end piece. Take this part, put it right underneath your belly button, okay? From here, take this side. You want to start wrapping it, wrapping yourself in your belt. Wrap it around your body. This way is a little, you got to reach around your body. Put, take it in there and just put it on top. Again, you want to try to make sure that belt is all together, okay? Pull it all the way around. I always do a double check on each one of these ways. You can tie it. Always do a double check right before you finish and make sure it's all together. We end in the same result. One side on top, one side underneath. Okay? Go through. Pull it under. Pull it nice and snug. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So now, take the side that's on top. Go underneath. Go through again the same way. Side on top. Go all the way around. Pull it out. That was the third way. That was the third way. Okay, the last and final way to tie your belt. Well, let me not say final. I'm sure there's other people who tie their belt a little differently. But this is another way you could tie your belt. Okay? This one, we want to get it nice and even again. Get the ends together nice and even. Pull them all the way across. All right, now watch this. I'm going to put it around my body like this. Okay? So now, it's all the same piece, see? Got it around my body. I'm going to take the ends. Here are the two pieces, the two ends right here, the two ends of the belt. Go through the hole here. Pull it nice and tight to your body. Okay? Nice and snug. Again, 
Double checking, making sure that that belt is even again. Okay, side that's on top. Go underneath again. Uh oh, I lost my my grip of it. Let me start over. Okay, and there we go. Okay. So, side that's on top, go underneath one more time. Pull it nice and snug. Not too snug because this part gets a little twisted up if you pull it too tight. And from here, pull it all the way through, not your belt, you're done. All right, that's four different ways to tie your belt. Let me know if you have any questions, you can make some comments. We can help you guys out with that, but parents, those are the four ways. Students, those are four different ways to tie your belt. No more excuses. Everybody tie your belt. Get ready for class next time. Power, peace, purpose. Thank you, guys.